pondering again. Even when I say good morning all, for some of you it's good night. Because it doesn't matter what it is, you can't have one without the other. For in the absence of that which is not, that which is, is not. I love that saying and at first I thought it was just a tongue twister. But if you ponder it long enough, you start to see, sense and feel exactly what it means. This world is full of contrasts, especially the light and dark parts which seem to occupy many of us these days. But surely we can't have light without the dark. For many years they operated in the shadows, the grey areas of life shadowy figures, indistinct and creepy. But as our light has grown, become brighter, then, by contrast, the shadows that we cast have become darker, sharper and more clear. So if you care about the environment and shine your light in that direction, then you will clearly see in sharp relief evidence of a dark side a distinct shape, pattern and form. If you care about peace and shine your light in that direction, then you'll spotlight unrest, conflict and wars everywhere. Your light creates the contrasting darkness. The brighter your light, the greater the darkness appears. Yet you can't have one without the other. Remember the toddler trying to run away from its shadow. It can't be done. But also remember that without your shadow, your light would be extinguished too. If you want to be a light, a beacon, a candle in the dark, then you have to acknowledge the dark side is there too. Be a bright spark, be a shining example, be illuminating. You can radiate your lightness into the shadows and take away the fear of darkness, both for yourself and others. Simply glow. The dark literally and symbolically engenders fear. The light brings relief from that fear. Simply glow. It's always darkest before the dawn. All you have to do is be glowing. Be happy, be confident, be a shining example. The more you glow, the stronger your light, the more you push the shadows away. The darkness will be held at bay because it can't come into the light. Your light will reflect a shadow side, but it can't envelop you because you are the light. Others feel safe and secure and relaxed and at ease to be around you because your light keeps their shadows at bay too. But it takes a flame to light a flame. You started life as a bright spark and now you're a flame. Share your fire with others. Ignite their passion, their dreams, their pathway. The more fires we create, the brighter the dawn will be just as the sun creeps over the horizon, pushing away the dark night. You are my sunshine, my lovely sunshine. You make me happy when skies are grey. <laughs> Bring warmth and joy, happiness and life, love and laughter to all those around you. Don't waste your time and energy, your fire and passion chasing shadows. Just as the sun rises in the sky, the higher and brighter you lift your light, the shorter and less significant your shadow becomes. 
So be a shining Chikara Reiki Do master example. Well, I've got to be glowing now. Goodbye.